Hi everybody, this is Cy from Cyanide Software. Uh, we're joining up with our friends at Nova Edge and we're going to be doing a webinar on our new Disperse plugin for 3D Studio Max. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to go through, we're going to paint up a practical scene and show off all the new um, features that we've added into Disperse uh, and then also take some questions at the end. So. Um, if you haven't heard of Disperse, Disperse is our painting tool uh, in 3D Studio Max. Uh, ideal for doing landscapes, putting people in your scene, cars, you name it. Uh, essentially, as you paint, as soon as your paintbrush stroke is done, uh, it just dumps it right into a full mesh. So um, it's one single mesh. It'd be very similar to um, like a scattering program. Um, it is also uh, optimized for the popular render engines. Uh, we're working with Corona right now. Uh, V-Ray is done, so if you were to have this many V-Ray proxies in your scene um, and rendered it, you'd get the same exact memory management that you would get using Disperse. So pretty much you're not going to see a bump at all in memory uh, rendering these scenes. Um, if you haven't um, heard of us, uh, go to SinaiSoftware.com. Uh, simply go in and sign up and you'll be able to go in and trial our software. Uh, just simply log in, go to software users and click on the orange button, say trial. We also have a practical scene, um, this actual scene here uh, that you can download and play around with. Um, and maybe you can do that while we're working on the uh, scene itself on the webinar. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a good one. See you.